Alright, hello everyone and welcome today to the next Darksiders 2 DLC called The Abyssal Forge and we're going to jump right back in. As you can see I had to select my downloadable content and then choose my campaign which actually is something I always forget to do. Well actually I basically forgot to do that for uh, the last DLC and uh, I just remembered it now. So here we are in The Abyssal Forge. And already we have a big open area. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. No more Void Walker. I was wondering where they put my pistol. As you can see, they removed some uh, some of your powers. This is an um, this is Soul Splitter, but they removed the other power. You can't shoot portals in this one. So okay, it looks like each downloadable content has uh, its own special, unique powers you can use. And boy, I do not want to touch this goop. All right, see, so yeah, I'm probably to supposed to come here later. Uh, later. This is no place for a horse. Oh, you can't summon a horse here. Well, looks like we're walking this DLC. I was hoping I get to, you know, use use despair, but I guess not. So obviously, yeah, you're supposed to walk forward into this place. Just for the record, I do have Assassin's Creed 3 downloading on the back burner, but this game actually came out first. So I'm going to play this first until then. Sweet. Oh yeah, if I step off this, it'll uh it'll relock, so I have to soul split. Yeah, you can switch between both deaths, I know. Why would I need to switch forms? Isn't this all I need to do? Shit, can I make this? Okay, good, I did. <laughs> you immediately fall into the piss lava. So hopefully this one will be a bit longer than uh, the last one. I actually don't even know what, what the story behind this one is because it came out so suddenly for me. Ooh, and we're going to have to place more balls and more holes. The Iron Glade. Alright, okay. That's right, Soul Splitter wasn't an available ability for the last DLC, now it is. The last DLC made you use portals. What a health pot. Oh, wait a minute, I'm going too far. Okay, yeah, that's right. If you go too far, you'll you'll lose service. So, wait a minute. How can I hold that open? The shit Oh, that's dust. This just says to sit there. <gasps> Something up here. A shortcut. There's the ball I need in there, but if I go too far down here, I'll lose service. <gasps> Death turns into Time Warner. Yep. Too far. Show me the way. Oh, that was helpful. <laughs> that was not helpful at all. Cause I can't move death once he's on here. Oh, it looks like there's even an even higher area. too far I can't hold this down because I'd have to move the statue and that's uh, banishes all of them 
There you go. Some gold. Oh, sweet. Oh, hold on. I'll close the window. Before fucking my door comes completely off the hinges. It is still very windy. Yes, it is the aftermath of Hurricane Sandy. So, bear with me on stuff like that. Yeah, right? Like, right about here, you start to lose service. Yep. Hmm. That's to be something I'm overlooking. You can't drag this thing, can you? No, nope, that's a permanent statue. You can't do anything with it. Unless... No, I don't really have much to say unless. What is this room shaped like? That's where I'm standing. Yeah, the death I'm controlling. And then there's a little... There's dust just chilling there. This, this circle must mean something on the ground. Oh, wait, can I weigh this down? Okay, and then I'm supposed to, what, unsummon it? And then leap through it? Nope, that's not it. You would think you would stand right here and summon it, and then leap through it. Oh, and it also lowers the first set of, uh... Pointy spikes over there. And yeah, this will probably give me enough service. Come on. Sweet, I made it. Both of those doors. So wait, what's in here? Oh, okay. So what I have to do is one form of death actually has to be standing on there, and death himself has to be on another one. So I have to unsummon. Here we go. I'll have him stand here. And green will go back up here and grab the ball. Or I'll uh, stand on the plate. We have the gigantic glowing testicle. Maneuvering it into position. Brought up a gigantic bridge from the sludge. Oh boy, here's a fight room. Hmm, I wonder if those bars are going to suddenly activate. Uh, a visitor. <laughs> I'm afraid my home is quite a mess. Speak plainly if you value your life such as it is. Oh, how rude of me. I am a smith, a visionary architect, sculptor, creator of... Here's my left arm. ...resides in this realm. And you must be an agent of the makers. They've trapped me here for thousands of years. Now they think my death will be They are not forgiven. The Mad Smith. Oh shit! That's not lock on! <laughs> I completely forgot how to lock on. Oh, they automatically gave me the pistol. Perfect. 
How do you use powers again? There you go. Oh shit, that was a big attack. Alright, how do you play? I completely forgot how to play. Ow, he has a shockwave. Here I was thinking we could be friends. He's blocking now. Oh shit. <laughs> Don't push me off. Alright, one more charge. Ow. Dude, his health bar is non existent. There you go. Well, time for you to die. Wait, please. You must wait. You mustn't cut off my head. A madness has blinded you. Mad am I? You <laughs> now, let us not be ruled by our baser instincts. We can help each other. Answer my questions and I will stay my hand. I won't ask again. Where are we? You paid ten bucks for this and you don't know where you are? A void between the tree of life and the tree of death. It's a rather pleasant place for a visit, is it not? Or an eon of imprisonment, as it were? <laughs> You're such a genius, why haven't you escaped? Hmm. Transportation is no obstacle for a smith such as myself. The makers have sealed the portal. Or so I had thought. The power of corruption has broken the lock of your prison. But, but how? I, I don't... Oh, gods, what could it do? Uh, wait, wait! Whoa, don't what? Leave. You have to help me. What's with a sudden change of Why? tone? My masterpiece. It, it threatens countless worlds. The Abyssal Forge is a sentient being of living stone. And it is crafted in an implacable army. If the portal seal is unlocked... Of the Abyssal Forge will invade other realms. All right, not my problem. Is any of my concern. Ah, you don't understand. I crafted the Abyssal Forge to harness the power of the Abyss. It lives. It breeds. It creates constructs that can then build yet more Abyssal Forges. <laughs> so it's basically like corruption. It builds and feeds well, itself. Uh, unlike myself, the Abyssal Forge is utterly insane. Its constructs will destroy everything in their path. You should not have meddled with the powers of the Abyss. You must unmake this. I... I have tried, yet I cannot. Damn you. What must be done, then? I need you to go spend the next First, five hours working with this. this island. The waters here are deadly to your living flesh. However, I can make a talisman to shield you. But first you must bring me the right materials. Alright. What does he have for trade? Nothing good. Wow, look at all this crap. It's terrible. Oh, I don't even care about secondaries. Uh, Wayfarer's Shroud. Down defense, no strength, but more guilt, experience, and critical damage. How much strength do I even get from the one I have? See, oh, they still have an ad compare. That's lame. Well, not like I'm swimming in money like I used to. This is pretty good. No more critical damage, but more strength, more everything. Crown of the Dead. Oh, no, this, this is Cell. Which is exactly what I kind of want to do. Here, you can have this. More defense, more crit. This might be worth wearing, but all this crap isn't. Alright, now I should have enough. Warlock. 